to give you uh, the sense of the perspective of a parent or a parent who's enrolled in your course as an observer, I've logged in as a middle school parent, uh, and you can see just like yourself, you'll be t uh, middle school parents will be taken to a Blake homepage. Um, most middle school parents, uh, based on our focus groups, uh, talk about using the calendar view uh, first and foremost. Um, some of them look at the uh, month view where they can see all of the course assignments based on the colors uh, located on the dates and set, have a sense of what the assignment's coming up. Some, like students, also just use the agenda views to look at uh, today or the uh, week ahead. Um, so this is a, just to give you a brief sense of what parents can see from the calendar or the assignment uh, point of view. They can have a quick uh, reference into what the assignments are. Uh, for each of their students' uh, classes, and then they can go into the details of what those assignments are. The other things that parents um, uh, talk about uh, accessing from time to time is the course homepage. And so you'll notice that as I scroll over the courses list, um, when I go into the uh, Chambers uh, course, you can see I'm taken to a homepage that reveals what the intention of this uh, teacher is in terms of contact information and some of the assignments. Um, and these home pages will look different from course to course. So as I go into the English 7 uh, page, I can see that uh, there's contact information for uh, Ms. Gadaleski, but then I can also access the syllabus uh, for the course. I can also access the uh, week um, planning week uh, for the course, and of course, um, all the assignments for the course as well. And then finally, another example of a pre-algebra course where I uh, get a sense of what the overview of the year uh, would be or s uh, skill quiz information. And this is really helpful for parents to have a sense of what the intentions of how your course is designed, not only in the online space, but the kind of interactions that are um, occurring in your classroom as well. So this is just to provide you an example of what parents will see on day one. Students will see something very similar uh, to this. The only thing that they will have the ability to access are the grades at the top. Um, and you can see that uh, because I'm enrolled as a parent, I can't access any course grades. Or if there was any interactions like discussions and quizzes, um, students will be able to access that. Parents enrolled as observers cannot.